here at home, we're watching the weather, too, and the temperatures. And uh, we're hoping we don't hit that heat wave status, but you never know. It's starting to look like it outside okay. today. And the heat and humidity at least is going to continue through the start of our weekend as well. But what I can recommend is you definitely find some relief. Get some shade today and drink plenty of water because it is one of the hottest days of the year here on your Friday. Weather alert day is in effect for the heat and humidity. So definitely if you will be outside, you want to minimize your time out there in the peak part of the day and get plenty of fluids. Water is your best choice. Now we are looking at the possibility for some thunderstorms around today, this afternoon, and evening, and once again tomorrow on Saturday. So we're going to continue the weather alert day into your Saturday, starting off very warm once again with those heat index values, what it feels like outside above 100 degrees in the morning. And then we'll be tracking around uh, some strong to severe thunderstorms as well during a day on Saturday. So we'll keep that weather alert in effect. So here is our storm chances. Let's talk about thunderstorms here. For today, we have a marginal risk of severe weather in the dark green. And then up into southeast Ohio, you can see that's a slight risk area. A little bit more widespread chance for some stronger storms on your Friday. Now for tomorrow, the risk area does change a little bit. We get that slight risk into our southern and eastern counties. But I don't think we're quite out of the woods yet in eastern Kentucky. There is the possibility for some storms on Saturday as well in that region. And conditions definitely are changing a little bit. We're watching some storms this afternoon as well. Any storm that does form could have some heavy rain and strong winds. So if thunderstorms continue to form over the same locations, that could be a flooding issue in some locations as well. But heavy rain and lightning as well, a possibility with any thunderstorms that do form. All right, so here's a look at our radar and satellite. Right now, things are okay. A couple showers in our northern counties, but we are watching a developing line of storms in the parts of Ohio. I pointed out to you here not too long ago. And some of these do look strong across that area, and it will be making its way into our viewing area within the next hour or so. It's fast moving. It's not going to be all that slow. It'll be actually blazing in through here pretty quickly. Now, notice there are a few warnings in Ohio, a severe thunderstorm and tornado warning up there. That's also the higher risk area which is what I just talked about. So we'll watch this line develop. There is a chance for one or two of these storms to be on the strong side as it makes its way in. And continuing to have high pressure and the heat and humidity it is on for today, that could definitely fuel a fast-moving round of showers and storms across our region. So let's look at our future cast. About 2 to 3 o'clock, that's when we'll see some of these storms make their way into our region. If they hold together, still some uncertainty on that. But a quick heavy downpour, some lightning and flooding, definitely a possibility with them. And then heading in the afternoon, still remaining warm and humid. Temperatures in the 90s, heat index values near 100 with the sunshine. And it'll be very sticky even after those shower and storm chances. So heading into this evening, we'll look for some more heavy downpours into Kentucky. Flooding is a possibility with some of these. But again, these are the slower moving ones. They come outside the peak heating of the evening. So heading into tomorrow for Saturday, things look good early, but it'll be very, very hot. Perhaps a few showers in the morning. That could help to reduce our temperature just a little bit by the afternoon. But still very sticky and humid, feeling like 100 degrees or more ahead of our next round of storms and these could have some gusty winds with them as they move eastward again the strongest ones will be in our southern counties they'll form into parts of kentucky and ohio be a little bit stronger in our southern counties and then into our eastern counties as well finally out of the way there by the afternoon 3 34 o'clock this is when things start to cool down a little bit it'll feel more comfortable heading into sunday maybe a few showers in the early morning but the rest of sunday looks pretty good the afternoon more comfortable and warm, but not too humid into the 80s and a little bit of relief from this summertime heat that we've had the past few days outside. So Sunday will be a little bit more refreshing out there and maybe still a spotty shower late night into Monday as well. And that seven day forecast, it looks pretty good after our weekend of weather alert for heat and humidity and those storms. Look at next week into the 80s. More normal for this time of the year and not too humid outside. Plenty of sunshine as well ahead of a spotty shower or storm there come Wednesday night and Thursday.